We get to see the boys in action for the first time, as it is the Newcastle Jets taking on Sydney FC in the Australian Cup. As, uh, yo, it, surprisingly enough, we are the odds-on favorite to win this one, which I am surprised with, because Sydney FC are usually, a, you know, a pretty good team, as, uh, you know, we are looking to really live to, you know, not only our expectations, but if we can go on and win this fucking Australian Cup right off the rip, that will be fantastic. I know they're rocking with a 4-4-2, which is fine by me. That is totally cool. Uh, we did do a slight change to our tactics. We are going to go with the three forwards in the front uh, for a 4-3-3 with a defensive midfielder still, which I just realized he is not going to be in the squad. So, yeah, we'll probably have to rock with something else. Because uh, I think... Yeah, I think... I mean, he's going to be a star and a half, so it's not terrible, but I, we should probably just rock with... Yeah, we should probably just do this. Because there's a better midfielder out here that we have. Well, maybe not. But, I mean, we'll just use Daniel Steins for now. Have him not be a defender, first of all. Uh, we'll just have him be a box-to-box. -box. See if there's anybody that is just that can work as a deep-line playmaker. Can we... Now it looks like we don't really have one. Well... I don't want to have two box to boxes. Well, shit. We are in a bit of a pickle. Uh, first of all, let's make sure we filter the B team out of here. Yeah, so we just have the senior squad. Yeah, that's unfortunate. So I guess we'll just run this. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm sure that that will be fine. Just a 4-3-3 three, three against a 4-4-2. Four, four, uh, I'm, I'm predicting a 1-4. Two victory for us. I think, uh, as far as I believe, that we will score first. I think Archie Goodwin's going to get a score probably within the first 10 minutes. Sydney FC will tie it before the end of the half. And we'll go out in the second half and, and get a W. And get that uh, that second goal that, you know, as far as they reach to the semifinals, we are in the quarterfinals. So if we win here, we just got two more games and we'll... Beating the Australian Cup Finals. That is massive. Absolutely massive. A lot of... They want us to push a little higher. We'll see what we do. We're just going to run with what we got right now. And, uh, you know, we'll just play it by ear. We're actually pretty good as far as familiarity with the tactic, which is great to see. Nice to see. I know we've had a lot of... Uh, we had, like, probably... If I had to guess, probably about four friendlies building up to this game. So we're, we're pretty... Uh, Locked in. Everybody's pretty much fit. Everybody's pretty much familiar with the tactic as far as to a degree. And uh, we'll see what, what happens here in this first game. So just as far as when we're loading up here, uh, as far as how I like seeing the game, I like the sideline view. I'm, I'm a sideline view guy, and then I have the replay be flipped. So that way it's, it's a different look each time. So that's just kind of what you're going to see when we load up here. All right, boys. Hey, let's go out there and give the fans their... Their money's worth here. Yeah, this is a big game for us. Yeah, first fucking game coaching. Yeah, you're yeah, very lucky, very excited to be here. Right? It is so crucial. We want to score early. And, uh, yeah, I know we're going to play. If we play the level that we're capable of, we'll be just fine. Yeah, I mean, we, uh, which is, I think those recent forms, I think that's from the previous season, because we definitely have won our friendlies. <laughs> as, uh, we haven't drawn or anything with the friendlies. We've pretty much been kicking the shit out of people. Which is, you know, that's, that's friendlies for you. It's kind of whole name of the game, really. As, uh, we'll see what we do here. We're gonna zoom in just a little bit if we can. There we go. Get this mouse out of the way. So we'll see what we do. Building up on the back of Sydney FC. That could have been bad. Oh, they, uh, they still get in front of it. Jordan get to get a hold of it. Yeah, they're already in the box, looking for that cross, potentially here. Yeah, that, there we go, get it out of there. Well, shitty clearance, right out of the gate. Don't like that. Don't like that, another cross coming. Got three in the box, four now. Yeah, just keep that shit out of here. Keep it out of here. And uh, I hope that's not going to be a yellow. Okay, that's good. Well, at least uh, nothing crazy happened during the highlight. 
Ah, well, that is a throw in. So, but we would uh, be able to do something here in the first, like, ten minutes or five minutes in, and they've had the ball the entire time. Oh, no, we've gotten a shot in. Huh. What's happened during the... Uh, so, well, that was... Well, that was... We don't like that. We don't like that. Yeah, I really don't like the XG story being up there in the top right. I'd rather have the visualizer, so we'll probably switch to that. Well, that's a terrible pass. Thank God he couldn't get there. And yeah, let's kick it down to Archie Goodwin. Well, we're playing like a bunch of fucking assholes right now. <laughs> you know, that's, that first goal from Archie Goodwin, I don't think it's going to happen this first half. We have looked god-awful. Oh, there we go. The Steins, way to bounce back into it. Beautiful through ball. What a chip shot. Oh, and it hits the fucking top bar. God damn it. Oh, man, that was br uh, beautiful, though. From Steins, and hey, come on, give us a free kick here. That's a little too far to get us on goal. That was a hell of a chip shot, though. Yeah, now we can change. Well, every time I want to change the XG, you get a highlight. We're getting a lot of highlights so far. Might have to change that. I don't know, though. We're only six minutes into the video. We should be fine. I don't sound. I'm liking these through balls. Oh, come on, good one. We got a two-on-one. Kick it back. Oh, you fucking... We needed that. That was a hell of a look. That would be a one-on-one -on -one right at the top of the box. That would have been nice. Yeah, let's... God damn it. <laughs> oh, my... Uh... Opposition's getting too... We've been getting this a lot during the friendlies. I've been not wanting to test it out just yet. Because so far, I feel like we've been getting a lot of good looks with it. And we've done a good job as far as stopping goals. And so I think we, we're just going to keep it as is for now. We won't change it unless something bad happens. But we are running here. See if we can get a nice cross in the middle. Nah. Nope, nope, nope. But that should stay on our side. Nope. Oh, and Parsons gets out. I thought was going to stay on their side of the pitch. Oh, there we go. Wow, well, come on. You got to keep going with it. That was Parsons doing beautiful pass. God damn it. Yeah. Yeah, come on, defense. Can't be having that. Middle of the box. Right there. Yeah, you know, I think... Uh, I think we might have to end up pushing it up. Let's see what happens here in the middle. Because, I mean, just he gets in no problem. We're dropping down too low. Yeah, he's just, he's wide open. Can't be doing that. Cannot be doing that. We gotta bounce back. We have got, well, we got offsides. No, they got offsides now. Yeah, let's uh, close out. Let's always press. Because they're getting a lot of crosses in. Come on. Oh, that's a shitty little pass. What a long shot, though. I, he had to save that one. That was... I didn't think that was going to be that much of a shot, but that actually got right in there. Now trying to swing from the corner. Yeah, let me... God damn it. <laughs> Every time. Eventually, I'm just going to have to pause it on that screen. So I can change the XG. Oh, they got that goalie way out here. If we can get a... Stop here. Perfect. Well... Didn't think we needed the passer right off of, off of that. We probably could have just took our time and kept it on the, kept the possession. Oh shit! Long ball. Yeah, I didn't like that shot. Let's just wait until we get in the box. Cause we're getting a lot of shots on. Uh, we're not getting a lot of shots on on goal though. Is unfortunate, but we are getting at least a lot of shots on. But it's kind of a waste. We can't score off of them. We want to have actual good possessions, because we're giving up possession time, so we want to make sure that we can make the most of it. Let's see what we get here. Yeah, they're, they're able to really chew up a lot of the midfield, which I was a, a little afraid of, even with the, the three midfielders in the front. I think with how we're, we're placing, I think we'll have the mid block in. I'll have to take a look at their tactics at halftime, just to double check. Because the idea was to trap... Trap them on the outside, force them outside, and uh, then break away right off of the uh, the change of possession. But so far, they've just been passing right on through it. 
There we go. Well, hate that he cleared that. Because first of all, it was a shitty clearance, but really, we could have just kept possession. Oh, well, that could have been real bad. Thank God he missed that. That was, that was real bad. Just shitty clearance. Put it in the fucking stands if you're going to clear it. And he, Parsons gets it over the top. Thank God, though, O'Neal's there to clear it out of there. And a good save. Saves us from being down 2-0, because that could have been real bad. Oh, yeah, I guess we do have... Yeah, well, well, we only got 10 fouls. What I don't like is our pass completion percentage is very bad right now. It's at 67%. We need that to be a little bit higher. Tackles won, though, nice to see. Headers won, though, we need to be better. Yeah, we just I think we just need to be better all around, unfortunately, at this rate. Especially the defenders. Our defenders, 6.3 on the, on the grades, on the ratings. It's all been good when they have a better game so far. We're almost at the half, and he's got a 6.4. We'll see uh, see what we do if we move the uh, stuck in in the second half. Game's definitely not over. Uh, we just, you know, we had a really good shot on target. Just so having to miss and hit the crossbar. Parsons with a, another good shot here. That's 2-0. God damn it. Well, we are in a predicament here. We gotta change up something tactically for the second half. This is not it. Not it at all. So I think... Yeah, we, we do have a high press. Let's prevent the short goal distribution. I do still like the outside trap. But I think we're gonna bump up the line a little bit. Maybe to standard... Keep the higher press on. Just keep the transition. We're regrouping when we lose possession, which I'm, I'm fine with. I think we're going to keep all this. And when we're in possession, I'm looking to pass into the space. You know, get the set pieces if we can. And I think so far that's that's all working so far. Hopefully in the second half we can get some better looks in. Because so far it's just it hasn't been it. Defense hasn't been there. Especially with them running a 4-4-2 and us having three forwards in the middle of the pitch. we you know Usually the overload would work, but Parsons might make this 3-0. Thank God. Because he has just been all over it. The long balls have been there for him. See if you can get maybe a, even it up here at the half. Ah. Oh, Jenkins. Take your time. Fuck. We needed some good looks. So far, we haven't been getting any good looks. Besides the chipper. Besides that chip shot. Well, yeah, I mean, the XG is, uh... It's crazy, they still don't even have one XG. That is, uh, pretty nuts. As far as statistically, how are we doing on, on key passes and whatnot? Yeah, the, uh... Trent had a, had a really good shot with the chip shot. Man, just... It's terrible. We haven't completed a single cross, which that's not great either. Can't be doing that. Jordan Elsie, I mean, he's lost, you know, 50%. He's at 44% of uh, Errol's duels won, which is not great. At least Carl Jenkins and Brandon O'Neill, they're doing the damn thing for sure. As far as winning their Errol duels. Yeah, I think just Jordan Elsie, I, I think he just should not be out there, honestly. Yeah, he's got a 6.1. He's been god-awful. Might make a sub at halftime. We'll see. We shall see. Yeah, we got it. I don't want to throw a water bottle, but I'm definitely going to thrash my arms. Hey, we've been terrible out there. Come on, boys. Let's get out there and do something. We're nervous. Some of the guys up front are nervous. Can't be nervous, though. We got to be better. We got to be better. I don't know if we should go attacking, just because we're already down 2 now. We might as well try and get something going. Steins are the great through ball, though. If we can get Steins another look here, that'd be great. And that's a tackle. And they're running. Parsons now probably going to make it 3-0 with a well-timed pass. He kicks it back out. Oh, what a terrible cross that was. We got lucky there. Yeah, we really can't play out of the back so far I'm seeing. As far as we've been pretty god-awful playing out of the back. Come on. There we go. 
Alright, third gate. That's there. Ah! Thought I was gonna drop in. I was liking that. I was liking that. That uh, long ball over the top would have dropped right in. Yeah. Um. Oh, they are. Yeah, about to say he is wide open. I guess to Parsons. Parsons gonna make it three. Yep. Jesus Christ. Well, this has not been it. Chief called and said that is not it. We have been god awful. I mean, he was wide open, like, literally from the halfway point of the pivot. He's been open this entire time. He runs back. Just crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. We have been god-awful. God-awful. Not a single corner. So why are we even playing for set pieces? We can't even get there. Passing completion has been horrendous. Right now, are they going to make it four? Lord have mercy. Okay, well, we get it out of there at least, but... Yeah, this is not... Not what we were wanting. Not what I had in mind at all. We gotta do something, tactically. I'm just gonna make some subs. Jordan Elsie. Uh, it's terrible. Yeah, Matthew... Sherman's out there. He probably should have been starting, I guess, to begin with. Yeah, we'll have him be on defend. James McC... Ah, uh, you know... Archie Goodwin's been shit, which is not great to see. I think we're just going to keep the one one sub for now. So we only get three. Yeah, this is just... Oh, here we go, third gate. Nice header. Alright, good one. Oh, what a through ball! We got a shot! Jeez, ah. Well... I mean, I will say this, at least our shots that are on target, they have been so goddamn close to going in. Let's see how this corner gets put together here. We don't really need to look through the replay here. If we get a we're looking for that front post. They got a couple of guys right at the front post. We're marking the keeper. As not sure where that was going, as that did not even come close to the front post. That was just right there in the middle. Can't be doing that. Cannot be doing that. Yeah, that goalie just fucking cleared it. Come on, O'Neal. Let's get a good ball here. This is, you know, he's kind of the start of the offense, really. If we're playing from the back, it's got to be through O'Neal. What a shot. Too bad it was wide. Out of the box, but... I mean, again... Nine shots, just not on target. Not on target at all. Yeah, we're probably going to have to make that next sub coming up. So it looks like just stamina-wise. We're about halfway with some of the guys. Gary's uh, feeling it a little bit. Thurgate's kind of feeling it. I think, you know, Stein's actually did a really good job as the middle box-to-box -box guy. He's done a lot of good plays. Timmons, I'm not sure what I would have him do if we should, if, you know, if we would have had maybe a deep-lying playmaker, I think that would have helped out a lot. Oh, God, are they going to score again? What a save. What a save. They're killing us in the box. Anytime they get a, in that box, it, it, it's over. It, it's over for sure. So we haven't been able to stop anything. We're lucky it's not 5-0 at this rate. This has been embarrassing. Absolutely embarrassing. Yeah, Parsons has been money. They have, uh, they've been, they've been on one. They have been on one, that is for sure. Again, Burgess, wide open. Nobody there. Went for the long ball, Parsons gets there. If he's got one pass, okay, well. Thank God. Thank God. Let's, let's go ahead and make some subs. Yeah, we're going to take Becca off. Now, even though Reno, he's not technically a forward, he's more of a uh, winger. He's got the skills to make this work, even though he's not familiar with the position. Hopefully, it'll work. Yeah, let's just go with the overview. <laughs> just 
go with the overview. Yeah, let's always press. Oh man, I thought he was gonna get. I thought he was gonna top in that. That would have been nuts. I mean, O'Neal's been playing like shit too. It sucks because I feel like he's done. Like he's just not been as terrible as uh, <laughs> as uh, Jordan was, but he he's still been pretty bad. Especially for us being an attacking too. Like, we have had, like, only one good luck since we've switched to attacking. Another save. Another one. I think we're going to make this last sub here. Not sure if we're going to go O'Neal, if we're going to go Thurgate, if we're going to go Jenkinson. I, I know one of these corners is going to go in. Thank God. Good wins there. Nice, 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 nice. So yeah, let's get uh, Angus Thurgate out of there. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll try the deep line playmaker, and then for Tim's, we'll go with ball winning midfielder. Yeah, we're just gonna try to change it up. Maybe central. Yeah, maybe attacking center midfielder. Go, f you know, go with a lot of attacking. Don't like that we have automatic though for our wing backs. I don't like that. Just go support. Maybe we should go attacking. Just really go full on. Since we're already down. It's not a terrible idea. See how we... Yeah, let's just do it. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. James McGarry, though, is feeling the pressure. We'll have him still stay on support. Yeah, I think, um, I think the wingbacks, I don't think it's really going to work out. Because uh, I think we, we need to have fullbacks back there, not wingbacks. So you think they're they're playing a little too, too far back? They're a little bit higher up. Might work too, if we go with a uh, higher defensive midline, or higher, yeah, just a higher back line. Oh, it just skims the crossbar again. Yeah, fans are leaving early now. The XG's kind of getting up there. At least we have a one on the XG. Let's see if we can get a free kick here with O'Neal. This is a unique angle. That is too... Oh, never mind. Thought that was going to go in after the stop. But it was right to a Sydney FC defender. Free kick. Oh, God. Fergus gets to it. Top of the box. Oh, man. I I mean, <laughs> I thought that was going in the back of the net for sure. Well, German should have started. For sure. He, he should have started. He's been way better than any of our defenders have been today. Can we, we at least get a goal? That's all I ask for. Can we get a goal? Just tough because stats wise, really, they had you know four more shots, but it was the on target that was the difference maker. We gotta get better shots. Foul. Ah, something. <laughs> Give us something. They're having more corners too. Our pass completion. I, you, we can't win with sixty percent pass completion. We gotta get that way up there. Um, yeah, we got we gotta at least be in the eighties if we want to be a winning football club. Heading could be a little bit better percentage-wise, too. It, it was close, though. But we won more tackles. We might um, not be stuck in for the next game, too. We might just play it. Play it on the feet. Just see what we can do. Uh, we were definitely the much better team. I think once we made our halftime adjustments. So we only gave up one. Sucks we didn't even get a goal, though. We should have... Should have been a little bit better than that. So not a great start to the Continent King. Getting embarrassed in the Australian club. Or an Australian club. In the Australian Cup. Defense failed us. We're going to have to go to the drawing board for sure. Get the wingbacks out of there. Um, I would still stick with Brandon O'Neill as a playmaker. 
uh, play balling rather, uh, the ball playing defender. Even though he didn't have a good game today, I think with the right adjustments he can. If we had a deep lying playmaker out there, I think that would have helped a little bit as well. We uh, just tactically were not, we weren't locked in, which is going to happen. It's the first game. Uh, you know, first, like, a real game, you know, against, like, actual competition. I think maybe our friendlies being a little too easy might have hurt us, too. Because, I mean, we were beating teams by, like, 8 nothing, you know, 10 nothing at, at some times. And... So that was a shitty ball. Shitty ball. Stein's here, see what he's got. Great long ball over the middle. I'm surprised he's not offsides. Couldn't get a hold of it. Took it off the chest. Would have loved to see him be able to shoot that. That's unfortunate. That is unfortunate. Stein's here. Let's see, got potential long ball here. He's got numbers. He's got it. Let's go, Reno. We needed that. Well, we got a goal. <laughs> At least we didn't uh, we didn't get shut out. But Stein's there. Beautiful job. I think Steins has definitely earned himself a, a spot in the starting lineup for sure. Some of these passes, he could have two assists today if that, uh, if the, uh, that, that didn't hit the crossbar. Our first shot, <laughs> really our first shot of the game. That would have been, that would have changed the whole tempo of the game for sure. But that's alright. We, we think we got it figured out here. You know, we had to go to very attacking at the end to get a goal, but we got it. Nonetheless, we might push up our midfield as well, because we, um, we were playing a little, a little too low, maybe. But just our likings there is going to be a throw in, and that will probably be the game. At least we match the XG. They basically match theirs with a 2.94, but yeah, 23 shots. That is not great. Cannot be giving up that many shots. Sure, a lot of it did come from going to very attacking, but again, the passing uh, completion percentage has got to be better. That could have been four goals there. 289 attempts, though, and they had 319. So they... We didn't even have as many attempts as they had completions of passes. So, I mean, you, you can't... You can't win when you're up against that. But so far, the counterattack, it's... I, it's there. It just gotta be fine-tuned a little bit. And I think, uh, luckily we had this Australian Cup game to really figure it out. I think we also have a couple of more friendly games. So we'll be able to really figure it out, fine-tune the formation a little bit. The 4-3-3 with no defensive midfielder maybe hurt us as well, potentially there. But Steins, though, it was tremendous. And, and German, too. Like, really, all of our subs were the best players on the pitch besides our goalie. Because, I mean, that, that is true. I mean... Shout out to the goalie, though. He was fantastic. So let's go to the dressing room if we can. Give the boys some praise. So at least fighting out there. At least coming back and, and getting the goal in. At least put over Reno. I won't we'll say, hey, we're not, we're not happy, but... Let's see, where is he at? There he is. Oh, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> back to the end of it. There we go. Hey, you're outstanding out there. Yeah, that was... He, he very much was. Very much was outstanding, especially in a role he is not familiar in. Don't know if we're going to have him start there, but... He's definitely nice as, like, a super sub. Yeah, I mean... I mean, I don't think we deserved enough to deserve victory. It is frustrating. Very frustrating. Yeah, it's pretty obvious who's to blame here. Yeah, that's pretty... Yeah, it's, it was a bad day. Bad day at the office. Not the star we had in mind. But Rome wasn't built in a day. I think we got a lot of building blocks to work with. And yeah, just, uh... Not great, especially when you're the favorites. And you kind of lose like that. Grim way to go about it. But, what, you know, we'll, uh, we'll be back. We will be back for sure. As far as for the next time you'll see us for episode 3, what the plan is, as, uh, yeah, there's still some more friendlies. I think we'll, we'll start off 
uh, with the opener, Central Coast Mariners, and then we'll probably, seeing how the, the season goes, we'll probably then meet you guys again for the Melbourne Victory game and the Melbourne FC game. We'll probably double up for that episode. It's only two games in November, obviously because of the World Cup, I'm assuming. That'd be my guess, but uh, yeah, uh, that is the plan. Unfortunate. Unfortunate, though. A 1-3 to three loss in the quarterfinal. We did not need that. But, it's room to build, room to improve. We're just going to go ahead and take a look at these tactics, change it up a little bit, and we'll be ready for the next one. For the home opener, at least. And we'll, we'll definitely test it out with the friendlies and see how that goes.